Can you start by just telling us a little bit about your IB experience? So I originally, I never, I had never heard of the IB experience coming here uh, before I came to this school. In my middle school, I did, we did have some sort of IB program, but it was more uh, strict core academic classes. It wasn't really more about learning, but rather more about the grades and kind of just focus on that. So I was never really interested to begin with. And then the same with my high school experience growing up. I was never even interested in taking AP classes. And it didn't take until my senior year when my history teacher, Ms. McDonough, actually recommended me to take this class because history was, I planned on making history being my major and she recommended me to take this class, especially because I was really interested in 19th and 20th century history. So she went ahead and recommended me to take this class and I figured, you know, why not? So I went ahead and took the class and it was pretty difficult for me, but coming out from it, I learned a ton of skills that have proven to be valuable for me in college and I survived my first semester of college just fine. Mm -hmm. Menos gritos y más obras. Debías haber procurado que todo estuviera más limpio para recibir el vuelo. Vete. All right, so what kind of like maybe changed your perception of IB once you were there? So changing my perception, I would say just meeting the students. You know, it was a really small class, so I kind of got to really know the students well. It was, we were kind of like a family. We stuck together, like thick to thin. And it took forever for us to kind of get to know each other well, but we did it. And then by the time it was about Second semester, we just went at it together. It was getting very difficult for us, but we all handled it and we helped each other out when we needed it. We went as far as creating a group chat for each other. That way, you know, if we ever needed help, we can go over to each other, even with personal things. So it definitely taught me the value of, you know, keeping a uh, group together, it taught me the value of teamwork, and it definitely taught me the value of, you know, perseverance. It made my perseverance feel even tougher than I originally thought before. And it's just a very interesting experience. You know, I never thought that I would be surviving and doing well in such a rigorous course. And looking back on it now, I honestly made a pretty good decision because I'm successful right now. And how would you say the IB helped you become successful in college? Uh, it was helping me become successful in college because now I'm kind of like used to that experience now. It definitely exposed me to a lot more college work and a lot of the material that I'm learning, I've actually learned beforehand and it's helping me out because of the course load. I can definitely manage my time a lot better because I've already done it in high school and it's working out for me very well in college. What kind of history do you study right now? Uh, right now I'm studying American history. I just finished my first semester of taking early U.S. history and now I'm taking 20th century again, so it's definitely going to be very interesting. Awesome. All right. well, what do you want to do with that? Uh, I would like to teach, you know, maybe someday become a professor myself, and someday I would like to get involved in government. You know, I want to build up on some experience, first up with education, and then with a background like that, hopefully into government and politics and, you know, start a change of some sort. That's super cool. Uh, what kind of advice would you give to somebody who's considering doing an IB class for the first time? I would recommend that you take it because it's definitely going to teach you the value of hard work. Uh, for someone that came from a background of not really doing much for himself, I definitely learned a lot from it. And the fact that you learn how to value that hard work and that you determine, your, like you stay motivated and you stay determined, you may not realize it when you're working in that field, when you're in that school year, but when you look back at it now, you realize that you learn a whole bunch. And that's definitely what I've been keeping in my mind as I enter college. I learned so much, like now it's not as difficult as I originally thought before. At first I was pretty anxious and worried about how college was going to go for me. And now that I'm in college, I can definitely say that it's bearable and that I can handle it and that I figured out, you know, the skills that I definitely need to be able to keep working and to keep able to stay motivated. And that's something that I learned by taking a rigorous course like this.